and Jack Reaper here again and today we are at Taffington Boathouse I think that's what it's called yes we are Taffington Boathouse right here on the map just over the way from Convent so this is what I've decided to do with it during this playthrough got a little bit of a drink wall out the front here protecting this side from the, uh, from the road got the guard there just a simple little guard shack there but he's protected from the elements she's protected from the elements sorry about that we come round here we come down here we've got the little uh, machine gun turret up on the top of the general store there general stores out the front here so you recognize these shop fronts we've got a little bit of living area inside but we will make it round and we'll see them in a minute we come down here we'll junk wall there protected in between the two uh, two shops got the weapons there again with machine gun turret guys on the top protecting the place and the armour there. Across here we've got the little clinic for the area. You can come across here and come up. Got this lady, she's got a bed and different pieces in there. Let's get a look at you. For the needs that she has for selling on the uh, chem chems and different things like that. Obviously it's not a big main pharmacy. Got a little guard station here again looking this way down. The provision is just on his way out by the looks of things. They've got their little bar area here. A few seats, a bit of sofa, all covered over. Got barman there, barmaid even, is it? It is barmaid. So they'll all come here on the night time, they'll chill out, they'll relax. The farmers and that, that have been working on this little field here. Got a little brahmin pen there. Repurpose that little front area there. Around here and here's the workstation, a little basic workstation for them. Look at the weapons workbench and the armor workbench power armor workbench everything they could need in here got the toolboxes and different bits of storage that they've got piled up behind here so they can come in here and they can tinker with a few things as well I'll tell you what let's go in the back door so I kept this as the kitchen area here got a working grill and stove different bits and pieces got the fridge behind me and then we've got a little living area out here they can come out here have a smoke chill out relax take it easy you've got a desk there the table the chairs obviously been taken and used for something else at the moment but that work, there is a chair there at some point got a little bedroom at the back there that's the most private used to be private one they're gonna get because these ones are right next to each other a little seating area there and then if you come in here this is kind of my little area and we've got the bathroom there Blood stains on the floor. I thought they would have cleaned this up for us. Got a bed there. My companion's got a bed as well. And then we've got the desk there and my safe and all my little bits and pieces that I might need. And then what I decided to do with the roof is I actually used scrap and got rid of the actual roof part, put these steps coming up, and built them a little uh, wooden stronghold for the Minutemen up here. They've got the beds, they've got the storage, they've got all the guns and everything they need. There's a um, power thing there, power generator, there we go. This looks down onto the main front of the settlement there. Alright mate, there's a bottle falling down, there we go. Better. Sorry about that guys. So to uh, give my bottle is my, uh, my, my bottle, give my son his bottle there. So we come on back down, we come on back down into the front of the settlement. If I can get down past paper, we'll see. There we go. We come down, come round to the left here. We've just come out the front door there, in case you didn't realise. I'm sure you will have. If we go up to the left, we go up onto the guard stations that go across the top of the shops. Drop your ball again, mate. There you go. Now you're done with it. No problem. So we've got the guard stations up here. That comes across the roof of the shops down on the bottom. And we come down here and over here and here's like a little uh, living area again for the farmers and the different bits of people who work on the uh, the mechanics who work on the water purify key pur purification plant out in the river just losing all my words there got a little cooking station that's used chemistry station there it's got the sink in a little seating area here as well and then as you come out here we've got all the water purifiers in the river walkway all the way around access for everything power there as well 
tools that they might need. And that's it, they've got all the water purifiers and everything there they need, they can come around the front. And then this is the access straight across the bridge here. And this gives you into the back of the shops. And they have a little shared accommodation in the back of the shop, so they have the little bed and a little bit of storage. And the, uh, and the table for eating, chilling out and relaxing. And again over here, these ones are doing a little bit better for themselves. So they've got the uh, they've got a little bit extra storage. And then they've also built themselves a little porch thing out the back here, a little seating area so they can chill out and look down the view in moderate safety. They can also see on one of the road as well there. We've got the uh, junk fences sunk in for them. So that's my uh, Taffington Boathouse settlement during this payful. I do have another couple that I want to show you. Um, obviously on different playthroughs, they'll be coming soon. I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen. I hope there's nothing that you think is too floaty up there. There's only the one thick wall piece hanging over. I'm really happy with this settlement, how it came out. I do wish I had more uh, more junk for the decorating up and that. And that's why I'm getting these recorded now, so that I can go ahead. And while I... Oh, I thought there I'd left a random junk wall out, but it's not. It's on the side of that, so... Oh, well. Anyway, if you've enjoyed, please hit that like button. And to see more content like this, please hit that subscribe and that bell notification. Thank you for watching. Have a great night or day, whatever it is to you. And hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.